Some chum. Oh, that looks, yeah, that looks a lot better, actually. Yeah. I mean, I, not through my camera necessarily, but uh, it looks like there's more light in his face. Mm -hmm. I imagine all this equipment is expensive, isn't it? Oh, it's this hobby. You, yeah, yeah, you have hobbies, right? Yeah, hey. I'm a hubby. You're a hubby. <laughs> That's one of his hobbies, yeah. too. <laughs> Actually, I'm supporting two women. Oh, you the, are? The first Miss Egan gets half my pension, and the other, the one now, takes care of the other half. Oh, wow. Yeah. I'll be out on the street with a tin can. Brother, can you spare a dime? No, I was going to say, though, you don't have to worry about anything happening to your pension, then. <laughs> the pension will be well looked after. Yeah. I get rid of my car and get a, get a skateboard instead. There you go. Save money. Scooters are more yeah. Scooters have come back for some reason. Yeah. We don't have a car in England, so we get a lot of walking in. Well, the, well you're like, like you said, it's like a really old village, right? Well, we're in a, in a it's a growing, very popular oh. place, but we get free bus passes. In England, if you're over 65, get a free bus pass. Wow. If you are sick or need to see a doctor or a hospital, it's free in England. Yeah, socialized medicine. So if you need it, yeah. yeah. And they pay through the nose yeah. taxes, right? And this year in this country, we had 8,674 homicide with guns. There, you might have a dozen having a gun Five years locked up, no parole. Yeah. So they don't have any shooting. Yeah. They... You missed out on all the fun here, see? Yeah. Okay, yeah, showed. That's hey. why we fought the revolution, so we could shoot each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you go to England mostly when it's not. Half the time. year, then I come back for a couple of weeks. I got to go to it. They want me to appear at a reunion of former students that I used to molest, torture, and, and make life miserable for. And they love you. And, yeah, it, well, they, they, they laugh at it. The good old days, yeah. Yeah. But you so I'm like, England. Oh, sorry. I come back by way of uh, Seattle, attend the reunion, then come here. I go over to the, the Veterans Administration for my checkups and stuff like that, you know. Yeah. But you go to England when it's nice. Not like I go on April Fool's like Day. Oh, that's when yeah. you go. And I come back on my birthday, the Feast of Bald Angels. Yeah. When is your birthday? October 2nd. Okay. Yeah. And you do that, that's pretty much like clockwork uh, every year, huh? Yeah, yeah. yeah. She wow. keeps her happy. She has a place there. And, uh, Just can't get away from Mother England, huh? <laughs> well, we run down in London quite cheaply on the bus, senior rate, see. Yeah. Three and a half hour ride, and you're, you're there. Sometimes three hours. Oh. Yeah. And then, uh, well, what is a three and a half hour bus ride? That well, uh, no, I, they, they've shortened it. They used to go by way of coaches, about three hours now. But uh, they put you off right there by the Thames, and you're close to Trafalgar Square, taking, go to the theater, see a play. And uh, we can stay there at the uh, military club. They have uh, one called the Union Jack, and then the All Rank. So I have a card so I can stay there. But you weren't British military. No, no. But because I was uh, disabled and I have a card, okay. they, they honor it like we do over here. Yeah, right. yeah. Okay. So they're not, they're not really that stuck up about it. Yeah, well, it's, it's a plain hotel, but it's half the price that you pay because oh. London is pricey. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I never knew before I got there. I thought London was the whole big sprawling yeah. city. And it turns out, actually, London proper is this one square mile area. Oh, yeah, and yeah. And nobody lives there. It's just businesses. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, yeah. I never realized that before. But uh, it's been a few years since you've been, or you'd be amazed at the change, yeah. Uh, I was there in 2001, I think it was. Yeah, in, in the last 11 years, they've... Uh, they're building more hotels. They're getting ready for the Olympics. Right. Yeah. Right, yeah. Right, right, right. I don't know about that. Yeah. Um, that's right. Yeah, he talked about maybe going there but for the Olympics, but I don't know. I think it'd be just too crazy. 
Uh, I wouldn't get anywhere near because uh, I don't like to be near crowds with the, the possibility of terrorist attacks, you know. Yeah, so. Yeah. I'm kind of funny that way. Yeah. I averted a terrorist attack in uh, spring of 1940. Before we went to war, uh, I was at a, they call a Navy torpedo station, Keyport, Washington, outside of Bremerton. And uh, these guys try to break in. And. Uh, <laughs> the the corporal of the guard thought I was playing with my pistol, and I accidentally fired it. So I fired three more. Yet that summons a corporal guard to cover my mistake. So uh, they restricted me to base. Then about four days later, at a nearby ammunition depot, these guys try to break in. They were part of what is known as the Deutsche Bund. Deutsch, you know, German. Yeah. Boone is a group. And these people were unhappy with us because we were supplying the, uh, the British with the old destroyers. I think we should give them 30 guns, food, ammunition to get at their relatives. A lot of them had relatives in Deutschland or Germany, see. So then they, uh, they felt embarrassed, so they put me aboard the uh, USS San Francisco, which is a heavy cruiser. And even though I hadn't been to sea school, I went aboard it, and I was aboard it during Pearl Harbor and the big battle in uh, November of 1942. Well, how did you, wait, how did you stop these guys, though? Hmm? How did you stop the uh, German terrorists, though? Well, I took my pistol out and fired it, and they jumped off the fence and ran back to the car, see? They were trying to get in. They didn't know I was there. and. Um, so it was just a, a bit of luck. And uh, the, in the ammo depot, I think one Marine was guard, was wounded, and one of the terrorists was uh, killed. Yeah. Did they get the other ones? Well, they probably caught my, I don't I mean, know. Did they get arrested? Yeah, yeah. But that, that was way back, you know, in, uh, like I say, in the spring of 1940. Uh, yeah, Britain was at war, but not quite us. Yeah, well, it was only a matter of time, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. yeah. So. We are ready to go. Oh, what, whatever you say. You want to sit there? My computer's not super cooperating with the high definition, super high def, but we're going to do it really good. All right. So um, I thought maybe if you just kind of want to have Denise sit here and kind of be your person, you can kind of talk I to I sit you. there? No, Denise no. will sit here and you can kind of talk to her. You know, just someone you can kind of focus oh, on. Okay, right? all right. You, and I'm just so lucky to have this wonderful. But she disturbs me. She's so attractive looking, you know. I'm so I'm, I'm only a mere human being I with, with French jeans. <laughs> yeah. So I'm actually going to well, work corduroys. I don't have to. <laughs> <laughs> all right, shoot. And so we are all ready. And so. Uh, Do you want me to keep with this or just, is this okay? Oh, thank you. Yeah. The light stopped wonderful. it already, but. Sure. Okay. Is that even. Can you. Yeah, you can see the his eyeball. Okay. <laughs> so, All right. Um, there is. Okay, let's hang, let's just hang on for 30 more seconds here. We'll All right, yeah. The last few kinks. This guy. Because he really is kind of cute. He's got, like, I think the biggest tripod collection on the planet. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm amazed I've never seen the equipment. Like, I had a couple of people come before, but this is really very... Up to date, sophisticated, yeah. Did you get uh, copies of what they filmed? Oh, uh, what? Uh, you said you had people come before. Them. Oh yeah, they Did they, they give you copies. No, uh, some gave me a little something, yeah, but they offered me, but I don't have the equipment for. Oh, any. you don't have a DVD player? No, not, I had none of that. I don't oh. have that, uh, you know. You have a computer? No, no, no. Someone asked me one time. They said, uh, Egan, how come you're not on the web? I say, I'm a goddamn spider. So, no, I don't, my wife has a <laughs> cell phone, but uh, watching people use them on the bus and all that, I'll end up in the cell crazy, but they're always on their, their machines. Oh, they got their little iPhones and the Oh, yeah, and they got the, and just, uh, eventually, like, yeah, libraries will be going out. They have their books on these little, yeah. Yeah. she asked me one time, she said, why don't you get a, um, 
uh, cell phone, I can, I can call you when you're out. I says, I go out to get away from you. You want to call me? <laughs> I says, stress is a killer. Yeah, yeah, you get, you escape. Yeah. Well, I mean, what is yeah, that yeah, like yeah. an emergency? Like yeah. she ran out of frozen peas or something. <laughs> Yeah. Well, we'll give you some copies, though. You can at least pass them out to your kids and stuff. No, don't, don't, don't spend your money on that. Oh, no, no, no. I, I, you know, I appreciate your coming here, but I don't need any uh, souvenir. In fact, I give a lot of stuff away I had here because you get near the sell-by date, you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, I don't know. Uh, let's uh, thank you so much for having us, and I'll no, no. please take over, and we're ready to just uh, do a nice story here. So why don't you go ahead and do a little interview, and then so I guess what we'll do just real quick is Denise will kind of say hi, you know, yeah. do your name and how old you are, and then maybe a little bit before the war, kind of how you got in the army, and yeah. and um, yeah. then we'll do um, you know you just go into the day, and then you can go ahead and tell about you know there's yeah. stuff probably several years after that. You, you have course. a time limit on this? No. Yeah. So could, could I have a, a little sip of water, please, Let's before I go? Exactly. There's a glass over there on the sink. Okay. I don't. He got me wired up here. I could go up I and know. get it myself. You can't move. I'd rather have wine, but I don't have it until five. 